This is a representation of everything the show is going to be. Gambit jumps on Wolverine's back. It doesn't even look real or badass. It looks fucking... I don't even know what's going on. It didn't look like Dragon Ball Super. Don't mind me. I know I Super Saiyan Joku, you can get mad if you want. I don't give a fuck. My biggest complaint about Dragon Ball Super is how they started cutting corners with the animation and how shitty. And this is the way Dragon Ball Super looks, by the way. That's my biggest problem with Dragon Ball Super. And it's my biggest problem with this. He didn't even look like he's really on his back. It doesn't. There's no depth to it. And shit. This would never go down. And it doesn't make any sense. You wanna know why? Gambit jumps on top of Wolverine's back to ride. If this is the continuation of X-Men 97, like Marvel Disney claims it is, that would never fly. They hated each other. Wolverine never liked Gambit. And Gambit never liked Wolverine. And a few times they even tried to kill each other. Literally. It happened in the goddamn show. They would never be cool enough with each other. They worked on the same team, but they were never cool enough for each other to say, hey, jump on my back while I'm running. And the worst part about this, the worst part about this is that Gambit touches Wolverine's claws and ignites them. Are you telling me that Wolverine's hands are about to blow the fuck up? This makes no fucking sense. This show is not targeted to smart human beings who grew up watching this show. This is targeted to nowadays generation who is a fucking mindless fucking idiots who somehow get tricked into thinking shit like this is cool. And oh, the graphics are badass. No, they're not. This is lazy ass fucking work compared to what was predecessor. Fuck you. This is... So fucking bad. Wolverine's hands are about to explode. Whatever. He's gonna be there with bones sticking blood. I think Marvel Disney gonna show that bones and blood sticking out of his hands because they just blew up. Oh my god. And they try to make it all like I don't have it here, but they try to make it all like Magneto is gonna blackmail them and because this is the this is this is the last scene right here they're all lined up and they're all ready to fight Magneto Jean Grey got pregnant by Wolverine or Beast or I don't know they all gang banged her and shit uh and they're all ready to fight Magneto who all of a sudden is right there in the fucking X mansion and he has a book and the book he throws it at them and the book says Charles Xavier's last will and testament and he says read it it says that everything that Charles Xavier owned and created, including the X-Men, now belong to me. Yeah. And so, that was said in the very last episode of the final season. Literally, Xavier told him, I am leaving Magneto in charge. He's your new fucking mentor. Goodbye. And now it's like a mystery, like they didn't know and shit. This is not made for people who watch the original fucking show. Fuck you, Kevin Feige. Fuck you, Marvel. And fuck this ass. Hey, if you like this kind of content, how about giving this a like and a subscribe? And if you want to watch the full show, click on the link on the right or check the description.